like a chocolate Barbie or something. Oh my gosh. The top is an absolutely no. Hmm. For some odd reason, it's real. Ooh. That's gonna be cute. Hey YouTube, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Christian Teray. Uh thank you for stopping by. If you're new and if you're a returning subscriber, today is gonna be a bit of a different video. Today is my first clothing haul. My very first clothing haul. I will say it was a what's the word? It was a learning experience because I had to record two sets of videos, one for Instagram slash TikTok and then one for YouTube. So I had to do two separate try on type of videos and I will say it was a lot. Phone kept saying I ain't had no storage and it's just like, I pay for two terabytes every month. What do you mean I don't have no storage? But that's neither, neither here or there. We're gonna go ahead and get started. Don't wanna make this a long process. Like a chocolate Barbie or something, oh my gosh. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to start with Active. Let me pull up the name because I got quite a few Active pieces. So, where's the pants though? Alright, so first Active outfit I have is called the Effortless Clara Rib Seamless Bra Top. In the shorts, of course. Um... It fit pretty good. The only thing I had a problem with is like towards like the bottom of the top. It's like my boobs are kind of falling out. I did get this in a size large and I paid $12.49 for the top. And for the bottoms I also paid $12.49. Remember everything's 50% off so add another half. That was the original price. So yes, I did get the shorts also. I had no problems out of the bottoms. It was really just the top. Um, I do have a little back fat and a little back rose. So my rolls was kind of like falling out the back of it. But other than that, I do like this skin, this skin. I do like this color, this neon orange on my skin tone. It's very pretty and I know it's gonna be very cute once I actually wear them. I plan to wear these for like my trips that I have coming up, for like my excursions, doing like ATV, UTV, uh, zip lining, you know, just anything. Well, not nothing really dirty because it is neon. Cause then that mean I only be able to wear it one time. Cause I had some yellow pants and it didn't work out well. But yeah, moving along, I messed the names completely up. So the top is called Effort Effortless Clara Rib Seamless Bra Top, and the bottoms are called Effortless Zeus Rib Seamless Hot Shorts. I don't know why I thought it was called the same thing, but. Moving along. <laughs> this next active set is honestly the same exact set, just a different color. It is called the Effortless Sierra Rib Seamless Bra Top and Effortless Zeus Rib Seamless Hot Shorts. So same exact thing, kind of shorts wise, it's the same exact thing. They fit perfect, it was nothing wrong with those. Now with this top, only thing I had trouble with is this side that has the black on the side. It wasn't as like, it wasn't, what's the word? It didn't hold me up like this side of the top did. Like this is elastic so it stretches. It, it's too much stretch for me. So I'm probably just going to do it myself instead of taking it to the alterations people and just folding it on up and making it a little tighter because it's just too loose on the side. So that was all I had with this top. Honestly, all of the active tops, it's like they fit. Oh, I did get all of the active wear in a size large. So they fit the tops, they fit, but I should have just went up the size. That's what I'm thinking. Because it's like towards the bottom of my boobs, they're kind of hanging out. So yeah, moving right along. Next set we have, it seems like all of their active stuff is called Effortless. I don't know why, but whatever. The next set is called Effortless Juno Capri Rib Seamless Legging and Effortless Clara Rib Seamless Bra Top. Uh, Leggings were perfect, like nothing wrong with them. One thing I will say about fashion though is activewear with the items that I bought, everything is rib. I absolutely love rib. When I hear rib, I'm thinking like, yeah, this is gonna hold me in for real. So I absolutely love that all of their stuff is rib. Now, with this top again, it's the same as the orange one. It's just the bottom, a little leakage at the bottom. Other than that, it's fine. It's the exact one as the orange one with the top off, top 
from the back is out. It's like cutouts or whatever. Yeah, it's like a little crisscross action in the back. It's fine. I could have went out, but I'm still gonna wear it because it was fifty percent off. So why not? Oh, I forgot to say the price. The price of those also was the top was twelve forty nine and the bottoms were fourteen ninety nine. Now I did get the black outfit in the color gray also. Well, do they call it gray? What do they call it? In charcoal. I'm sorry. Tights, I'm definitely going to keep and wear them with like a graphic shirt or something like that. But the top, the top is an absolute you no. Know, hmm. No. Um, just like with the, what color is that? Just like with the neon one, the neon yellow top. This side, it holds me in perfect. But being that there's no strap on this side, my boob is just leaking over. And I can't wear this nowhere. So the top, it's a no. The top is definitely a no for me. For that, the top was $12.49, the bottom was $14.99. So the next active wear piece that we have is called the Effortless Kim Rib Seamless Romper in the color Bubblegum Pink. Now, I absolutely love this. I wore this in Aruba, so I didn't even um, get like a little try on. I'll just insert clips in there with it on. I absolutely love this, and I absolutely love like the keyhole that it has in the back. It's a real big hole, but it's pretty nice, especially because the places we went and where I wore this thing, we was walking um, like up and down the strip. We were walking in and out of clubs, so I was sweating real bad. And I was able to still have some like some a little air in the back. So I absolutely love this. But for some odd reason, it's ripped. It didn't rip while I was wearing it. But right now, it's ripped. I don't know if, here it is right here. Well, can you really even see it? Hold on. I don't know if I did something or what, but all I know is I wore it, washed it, packed it back up because it was time to go back home. And when I pulled it out today to do the haul, I seen a big hole. So I don't know. I mean, I can sew it back together, but if they have another 50% off, I'm gonna just buy it again and get the other color. They did have it in the black and brown color, I believe. So. It was a 10 out of 10 overall. All right, so for the last active set, we have Effortless Joy Strip Seamless Jumpsuit in the color Sand. Um, I, I didn't have any problems with this. This was $17.49. Um, I loved it. And I say I loved it because they added a, what is this called? I don't even know what it's called, but I was able to make the top a little tighter to really hold my boobs in. It was, it's really nice. Honestly, I have no, no, nothing bad to say about it. I do like the back of it. It has this, um, what is this? Elastic band. So it kind of stitchy in a little bit. And it's also real. So it was all good for me. So we're going to start with the bottoms now. Alright, so we're going to start with the bottoms. Okay, so we're gonna start with the jeans now. The first pair of jeans I have is called Now and Later Small Flare Jeans in the color Light Wash. These jeans were $19.99. I absolutely love them because of the different color freaking patches. Like, they don't look too childish to me because some patches they can be very childish. But I like these. I don't know, like, it's not doing too much and it's flare and it's freaking long. Like, if you wear heels with them, it'll like, it's not gonna be in the water. So they're perfectly fine. You can pull out a color of the different patches because all of the patches are two-tone. We got purple, pink, blue, and green. That's all the colors you need. Next pair we have are the Gimme Space Metallic Green Pant. These were $15.98. Now, I was a little skeptical because of this. Like when I'm walking around, people are gonna be hearing me. Like, what are they gonna be saying? I don't like that. But the reason I even got these pants is because I seen a girl on Pinterest with them on in the pink color. And I was like, let me figure out where she got this from because those are cute. You know metallic is in, it is summertime. So I was like, that's perfect. This is the perfect color. Um, Fashion Nova does have the pink color, but they were sold out of my size. So I just ended up getting the green. I know I can match something real good with green. It's green. What made me even get those pants was I seen a girl on Pinterest with um, the pink color on. And I screenshotted it, uploaded it to Google Photos, and figured out where it came from. I noticed Fashion Nova did have the pink size. Size. <laughs> they had the pink color, but not in my size. And you know how they be like, um, shop for similar items? 
I seen those right up under them. And they were also part of the 50% off sale. So I was like, I'm gonna just get these. And when the peanuts come back in my size, I'm gonna get those too. So I made them notify me when those come back. Now this next set, I couldn't wait till it went on sale. Y'all, I'm telling y'all, Fashion Nova is expensive. I don't care how much money I got, Fashion Nova is expensive. If it's not that 50 to 70% off sale, I'm not shopping. But this next set, I seen it on TikTok. This lady had it on. I seen it actually back in like, I wanna say February, March time, and I've been saving it for just that long. That's how long I've been wanting it. Now it's called Love Hurts Cargo Denim Jacket and Love Hurts Cargo Jeans in the color Medium Wash. So the only problem I do have with this set is the pants were a tad bit too big. I ordered a, at first I was gonna get all of my bottoms in the size 11, but once I started reading the comments, I was like, let me just size up to be on the same side. I actually could have stayed with a size 11 with these pants because they do stretch. They have quite a bit of stretch. Can I say that right? Quite a bit of stretch. Ever since I got these braces, I feel like I be saying my words wrong. I feel like I got a list. I be slurring. I, I'm just ready for these two years to be up, and I'm only six months in. Anyway, I couldn't stay with a size 11. I was going to send them back, but I'm just going to take these to my seamstress and have her take the waist in, and they're going to be perfectly fine. Now, with the jacket, oh, where is the jacket? It's somewhere in the bed. With the jacket, um, I am still working on my little love handles, so they do show a little bit, but I mean, I really don't care no more. So they're just gonna show. Or I may just wear a tank top under them, but oh, or I can get like some real long, thick, curly hair. Oh, that's gonna be cute. I'm ready to wear that, and I'm ready to take my hair out. <laughs> I'm ready to wear it out. <laughs> For my last item in the pants section, they are called Matte For You Cargo Jeans in the color Acid Wash Black. I paid $25 for these, so dang, these pants are $50? No freaking way. That's insane for some jeans. Okay, whatever. Now, like I was saying about sizing, how I could have stayed with the size 11 with those other ones, I definitely could have went up with these. Simply because on my thighs, it's, I'm scared to sit down in them. Like, I feel like these are gonna have to be picture type of jeans because they're too snug. Now on my waist, perfect. The way my waist fits in this, I wish they would've fit in the other set, the blue denim set. I wish it would've fit like that, but these, super snug on the thighs. So I would say size up, and I did get these in a 13. You like it? A 13, right? Yeah, 13. I would say size up if you have thicker thighs. Now with the waist section, it's going to fit. The thighs, it just isn't. And I like that all of their pants are long enough. I'm not that tall, I'm only 5'6", but if I wanted to wear heels with these, well, honestly, all the pants that I got, I could put on heels with them and they'll still be, they'll still look nice and not in the water. So I do love that about their jeans. It's just the sizing. I gotta get my sizing together. I am trying to lose weight, so my weight is going up and down and I'm just trying to figure it out. Now, I did order pornographic shirts, but um, after they confirmed my order, they told me that they had to refund one of my shirts, so that got sent back. So let's see, the first shirt is the Nirvana Swirl Smile Top. I actually wore these in a few try-ons when I was trying on the pants. Um, The shirt fits fine, it's just a graphic tee. Next shirt is called the Pink Floyd in London tee in the color pink, of course. Super cute, you know, basic, whatever, just a cute shirt. <laughs> the next shirt we have is the Nirvana in, I'm not even gonna say that word. Everything's gonna be linked, so just click the link. <laughs> Wash graphic tee in the color raspberry. I did wear this shirt too. I wore this in Aruba with some black jean shorts just to walk up and down the street once again. Something plain and simple. Now, I did not try those shirts on because, I mean, they just graphic shirts. Now, what I will say is, fashion over t-shirts are real cotton. Um, sometimes with Shein, you have to read their reviews because the shirts may look cotton on the model, but they be like, when you stretch it, it turns white, like the design fades. I will say these shirts are real deal cotton. They feel great. They're not like itchy, heavy. They're perfect. And I will say get your, like they're true to size. So get your size. Unless you would like a baggy size, then of course you would size up. For hauls will be coming. I absolutely love to shop. So uh, let's see, I usually shop with Shein, Pretty Little Thing, um, Forever 21, H&M, 
sometimes I go inside of the mall, sometimes I don't because there really don't be nothing in the mall. And if Fashion Nova keep having these sales, I'm gonna keep buying. <laughs> um, now I am starting to get into sneakers, just a little bit. Like I have a few pair of sneakers that I just got and they're still sitting in the closet. So I probably won't be showing shoes as much. It's gonna be more so of clothes. Yeah, clothes, not shoes. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching this video. If you would like to see more hauls from me, comment down below, please. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. And see you guys next time.